What's up, Duelists? MD here, and today, as you guys can see, we have a bunch of packs here to open. But as far as where these came from, believe it or not, this was actually sent to us by a fan through the Pokemon Evolutionary Journal on the most recent Mailbox Monday video. And there was a brief little note for Magician to send as well. So let's go ahead and read it now quickly. It says Magician's Descent encloses 14 packs for your channel. Thank you for all the great content you produce. Sarah with a heart. All right, thank you very much there to a really good, awesome fan, Sarah. I believe it, I believe her name is Jolteon. Jolting Jolteon? If I got that wrong, I'm sorry. We do our recording very widespread out, so it's actually been a little while at the time of recording since we did the mail video. But no, yeah, we got some really cool stuff here. We have a Raging Tempest pack, two Invasion Vengeance. We have three Maximum Crisis, which has some serious potential in here. And with the rest are going to be Duelist Pack Rivals of the Pharaoh, which is a pretty decent Duelist Pack, actually. I actually have the possibility of getting some cool stuff in here. Man, all these are just so cool. Invasion Vengeance has a lot of really fun cards you can pull. Send it with Raging Tempest. Like, there's just so much potential in all of these, and thank you very, very much, Sarah. It is greatly appreciated that you would think of me in a channel at all, even though I'm not able to post videos as often as I would like to anymore. But I made sure to go for this one here. So we're gonna start here with the one Raging Tempest. So let's see, we got Cyber 2 Tutubon, Cypher Spectrum, Fairytale Rayla. I really hope that more of these fairy tale cards would see play other than snow, but it's just not in right now. Pro probably in the future though. Got Shino Bird Crane. Super Heavy Samurai Stealth Ninja is gonna be our rare. Subterra Cave Clash, just a super. We have Machine Angel Absolute Ritual, Beginning of Heaven and Earth, and Cypher and Tranger. Alright, now gonna go for number one of our two Invasion of Vengeance packs. This was honestly like one of my favorite sets when it came out. Just because of all the awesome stuff that was here. Because I believe this set came out around my birth... Yeah, this set came out around my birthday. And just Starving Venom alone made me really want this set so much. Because I love the artwork on him. And there was also like a really... Lots of cool stuff in here too. Ooh, let's see where our super is. Ooh, it's an Ultra. True King, Barthardo stuff, Fathomer. Yeah, this was, I believe, the first set to where we saw the True King stuff emerge. So it's gonna go ahead and be our first ultra here. Awesome, awesome. Gradle Slimes Jr. I remember Gradles. Crestron Parasite Turtle, Paleozoic Marella, and Cyframe Accelerator. All right, Invasion of Vengeance pack number two. Got an ultra from the first one, so I guess I can't expect too much out of this, but it'd be really cool if we got. Sorry, Hiccup, and at least another ultra. That'd be really cool. So we have Crestron Rosenix. Mayor Mayor, Ketunar, Flower Cardian P Peony with Butterfly, Burnout. Oh wow, Danglong the first of the Yang Zing. Man, I remember when this was like a meta card. A meta extra deck card at the time. Those were the days. So hey, two out of two for Ultras for Invasion Vengeance, so yeah! Doing awesome, guys. Spread's Blessing, Poly Kami Chimera Crit. There. Chimera credit, there we go. And Dino Sewing. Alright. Can our luck continue with Maximum Crisis? Oh, man. If we could get an Ash Blossom out of this, I think I might faint in my chair. Alright. So we have Bug Signal, Prep Plant, Darlington Cobra, Phantom Knights of Wrong Manatory, Performer Pal, Coin Dragon. We have. Ooh! We did get a secret rare though. Unending Nightmare. Oh, very nice. Very, very nice. Gonna put that right there. So two ultras in a secret in a row. Like ultra, ultra secret. That is just awesome. Like really, really awesome. Yeah, I'm trying to keep my voice down because it's late at night and my family is trying to put my baby brother to bed, so that's why I'm not as loud, but I'm trying to contain my excitement. I'm trying. That's why it sounds a little awkward. So we have Phantasm Spiral Crash, Ghost Beef, Prayer Plant, Cordyceps, and Primal Cry. Oh man. Whew. That might have been it for our Maximum Crisis luck, but who knows? I mean, we got 
two out of two for Invasion Vengeance, so who knows, maybe we can get lucky again. So we have Phantasm Spiral Grip, Disciples of the True Draco Phoenix, Speedroid Skull Marlboros, Boa Baboon, DD Stone King Darius, True King of All Calamities, Just Star Super, Farm Power Revenue Dancer, Gift Exchange, and Speedroid Malicious Magnet. All right. To be fair, a secret was more than I was expecting out of these three. Maximum Crisis, so I can't really hope for too much more, because that's pretty cool to get. But hey, who knows? Who knows? So we have Kaiser Sea Snake, Speedroid Skull Marbles, the Zybos of True Draco Phoenix, Predator Plant Orphoscope, Orbeo, not a bad rare to get. And we have Supreme King Game Infinity, pretty nice. Ooh, set rotation. This is actually a short print common, so pretty cool to pull this. DD Ghost, Gift Exchange, and Speedroid Malicious Magnet. All right, so that's gonna do it for our Maximum Crisis stuff. Getting a secret out of the three, one out of three, and it's a secret, that's pretty good. I really don't think you could have asked for much better. And the rest of our packs from here are going to be Duelist of the Pharaoh, Duelist of the Pharaoh, Duelist Pack Rivals of the Pharaoh. And as I said, this is my favorite Duelist pack, because out of all of them, this one probably has the best stuff in it. Along with Silent Magician, Silent Swordsman, and there's a few other cards in here that are actually pretty decent as well. So we have Solemn Magician level 4, Blue Eyes Shining Dragon, Temple of the Kings, Sound Swordsman level 5, and our rare is Dark Magician of Chaos. Yeah, these were the ones to where you weren't guaranteed a super. It's not that they were old enough before that, it's just that's how I believe most Duelist packs work. I believe, don't quote me on that for sure. Alright, so we have Blast Held by a Tribute, Temple of the Kings, Dedication through Light and Darkness, Green Gadget, and Thousand Eyes Restrict. All right, not a terrible rare to get. So there's the Sound Magician, Sound Swordsman. Um, Lullaby of Obedience is in this, and it's, that's not a terrible card either. I'm just trying to think if there's like any other high rarity cards here. That ooh, speaking of the devil, and she shall appear, Silent Magician. Yeah, this was actually one of the really cool things that you were able to get from the Rivals of the Pharaoh. It's pretty much. Gains attack for how many cards in your hand. You have to attribute a spellcaster to special summon her. And she can negate one spell during your opponent's turn. So, pretty good. And the silent war the silent swordsman does almost the same thing, except he gains 500 for during every standby phase. So yeah, those were the main focuses of the set, but like I said, there was I know I know I know I said low Bible beans, but I think I'm missing like one or two more cards in here that were like ultras that were pretty good. Just at the tip of my tongue, I just can't remember them for sure. So I have Blast Held by a Tribute, Spirit Message N, A, <laughs> Spirit Message A, Spirit Message L, and Dragon Shrine. So we got three of the Spirit Messages in a row. That's cool. <laughs> I wonder if it's possible to get the entire an entire pack of nothing but the spirit message cards in the trap. Like that would just be spooky. Alright, so we have Sound Swordsman level 7, Red Gadget, Spirit Message N, Exchange of the Spirit, and Dark Magician and Chaos is our rare. I tell you, it's actually bugging me. Like, were there any other good ultimates besides those three? I'm actually having a hard time remembering now. I don't know, maybe I'll get lucky, I'll pull one of them, and I can show you guys then. So we have Silent Swords level 7, Red Gadget, Spirit Message N, Tribute Burial, this is our super. Hmm, what's this the one? I don't, yeah, I don't remember if that's the one or not, I don't think it was. I think that one might have had, I, I think I remember some people talking about that back in Monarch format, I think, but... Nah, I don't think that was the other one people were talking about, uh, the other really cool card in here. So Stronghold and Moving Fortress, Help a Murmur, I, if I butcher that one, sorry, Spirit Message I, Dark Sanctuaries are Ultra, and Dragon Shrines are Rare. Now this is a pretty old card. This I'm pot, oh wow, that is the wrong kind of sleeve, yeah, I've got like a whole tin of me of nothing but sleeves, Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh alike. So I had to go through some of this stuff here to make sure I'm getting the right sleeve, there we go. So that was like evil. That was like the field spell for evil Bakora back in the day. I don't know. I forgot it was an ultra rare in this set, though. Kind of surprised. 
Well, though, that one I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure is a reprint. I could be wrong. So we have Blast Out by Attribute, Temple of the Kings, Dedication to Light and Darkness, Green Gadget, and Fiend Sanctuary. All right, guys, so that is going to do it for this fan video mail here. Let me just gather everything together and we'll go over what we pulled. So we got Den Deng Long, first of the Yang Zing, True King Barthados, the Fathomer, Silent Magician, Dark Sanctuary, and Unending Nightmare to end it off. So we got four Ultras and a Secret out of all the packs that Sarah sent to us. So really, really good. So thank you again very, very much, Sarah, if you are able to watch this. I am very, very grateful that you would even think of me and my humble, tiny little channel here. And if you guys like this video, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And with that, I'll be seeing you guys around. This has been Magician's Descendants, and I will catch you duelists later.